Jesus saw the crowds, he went up on the mountainside and sat down. The disciples came to him and began to teach them. He said, Blessed are the poor in the city, for they are the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they will show mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called the children of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted because of righteousness. For they are the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you. Women in Saul will persecute you. And forces say all kinds of evil things against you because of me. Rejoice and be glad, because great is your reward. Same way, if you persecute them, the prophets who were before you, the prophets of the Lord, the Beatitudes with Jesus. Now, these are blessings that came from the very lips of our Savior, the Lord Jesus. In no direct order, we speaking from the last, verses 10 and verses 11, and even verses 12, as I'll take my efforts to that. He says, Blessed are, are those, blessed are you. Who are persecuted because of righteousness, for they are the kingdom of heaven. Eleven, blessed are you when people insult you, persecute you, and falsely say all kinds of evil against you because of me. Take note of the phrase because of me. Look of John, the Bible says that the Sabbath is not greater than the master. If the world hates you, it's because it hated me first. It's no if they called Jesus Beelzebub or that he had demons, if we truly follow Jesus, we should, we, we should expect to be called similar names. If Jesus, the one that we look up to, the one who is the author and finisher of our faith, was called names, if we genuinely say that we follow the Lord Jesus, we should expect similar treatment from those who do not belong to Jesus, those who do not belong to the kingdom of our Lord, those who do not belong to the place where we come from. The Sabbath, the Bible says, is not greater than the master. He said, Blessed are you when men, blessed are you when people insult you, persecute you, falsely say all kinds of evil against you because. The Bible says one thing when these things happen. He said, Rejoice and be glad because great is your reward in heaven. For in the same way they persecuted the prophets who were before them. So the scars, the body of honor that the prophets of old would carry was their persecution for speaking the words of God. The accolades that the prophets of old were known for were the things that they suffered, the ridicule, the insult. They suffered because they stood for the cause of God. Scripture records the prophet Jeremiah was thrown into a pit. He was thrown into a pit because he gave the words of the Lord to the king. <laughs> did we talk about? Did we talk about the prophet Ezekiel? And many of the prophets of old, scripture says they were persecuted because. Ask us so 